Hello, my name's Carl, I'm 2 Echo Zero Echo Zulu Tango and in this video I'm going to operate the Raycal VRM5080 military radio. So I've had this radio for a few months now but I've never uh, operated it on the air. I've uh, tested it inside the radio room on a dummy load but never made any contacts on it. So it's a decommissioned military radio, it operates between 30 and 60 megahertz which allows me to get on the four meter and the six meter band in the uk uh, on fm uh, it has three powers five i think ten um and yeah so it has at low which is a uh, five watts uh, mid power which is 10 and high uh, is 50 watts on the radio um, you can tune in, you can actually pick your frequencies by dialing them in here. Uh, it does 25 kilohertz steps. It has pre-programmed um, uh, uh, memories as well, um, but we tend to just use channel zero and then you can just dial in your own frequencies uh, you know, uh, in there as well. So the plan today is I'm going to give my buddy uh, Paul at G1WHP a call on four meters. So this is plugged into my four meter uh, antenna, which is up on the uh, on the side of the house, and I'm going to give Paul a nudge on. Um, this, we've got a Zello um, channel that we uh, chat and plan things together with the rest of the. Um, either the Potteries Amateur Radio Club folk um, or a bunch of us who are planning events. We just tend to uh, have a, an open VoIP channel uh, on, on the um, on, on the Zello. So hopefully I'm going to give Paul a shout and see if we could arrange anything um, this morning on the 4 meter uh, band. So I'm running the, um, the radio off this um, adjustable power supply. Um, I think the radio could take 24 to 28 volts. We're running about 25 volts on um, uh, standby and receive. It's drawing about 0.6 um, amps. And uh, let me just change this to a another frequency. Uh, and on low power, if I just transmit uh, 2E0EZT, check in transmission. And that runs on one amp. Um, if I go to mid power, which is 10 watts, uh, yeah, this is 2E0EZT checking the uh, transmission on the radio. And then if I go to high power, and uh, this is 2E0EZT checking the transmission on this radio, that goes up to about 6.9 um, amps. So it's, it's actually not uh, a bad radio, efficient wise, for. The power it's drawing. Okay, I'll uh, hopefully Paul will be available soon to give him a call on the uh, Zello. I quite like this. Um, I bought one of those uh, Enrico T199 for the, the Zello. Uh, I'm, because we're using Zello for doing a lot of our planning for amateur radio activity. Um, but with this, um, this particular version of this handset, it gives you, it, it channelizes things. So, um. 05 Calum MOMC at 04 the Cleo Gang. 02 Pottery's Amateur Radio. 05 Calum MOMC 06 Fall. Right, so you can just, um, then you can just use this. Hello, Paul, it's Carl. Yeah, it's, uh. Yeah, I've just been uh, playing in the uh, shack this morning. Uh, what are you up to? Yeah, I'm. I'm all set up in here to um, do a bit of recording of the this VRM eighty. Uh, so I mentioned to you the other day that I was hoping to try and catch you in, so that we could. Uh, I've, I've put a few C CQ calls out on the four meter calling channel but it's 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 a daytime in, in midweek so i thought i'd just uh, see if you're around so that we can arrange just so that we can get a radio contact on it to test it out yeah i can 
can help you with that. Um, what frequency are you on at the moment? If you uh, um, are you on any particular frequency? Well, uh, I've dialed in seven um, seventy point four zero um, because um, it, this only does twenty five kilohertz steps. I'm on ten watts output, so we should make the distance. Inside, but we'll give it a go. I'll give you a call on uh, seventy point four zero. Yeah, okay, mate. Yeah, I am. Um, and then if you get, if you have difficulty hearing me, I can go up to fifty watts down. But we'll try ten watts and see if we can make the distance. Yeah, uh, G1WHP, 2E0EZT, I get you, me Paul. Maybe not. At G1WHP, 2E0EZT. Yeah, okay mate, yeah, that's on 50 watts, so I'm actually on full power going out. I realise that, you know, we both haven't got um, uh, ideal antennas on 4 metres. I think yours is indoors, you said, in, in the loft. But you're making the distance and uh, getting the contact, you're coming through, uh, you're coming through clear on the radio, coming through clear, so it's definitely a Radio 5. Uh, back to you, Paul. Yeah, okay, yeah, I'll take a standby. This is 2E0EZT, standing by. Obviously, this is uh, made for. Ooh, I never did get that. Um, I, I didn't quite get that one then. Uh, G1WHP, try again, mate. Yeah, no negative, mate. Negative copy there. Um, there's a lot of noise coming through with you. You're actually behind the noise, a lot of crackling. Yeah, no negative, no copy. It's working. The radio works. It's quite nice. Um, it draws quite nicely on the power supply. Um, the, the headset that I, I got for it the microphone must be must be loose wire inside there so that needs repairing um yeah g1 whp yeah all good copy there mates this is um this is better so are you back on the the original setup Yeah, Roger. Well, cheers for that, Paul. I'm going to um, cut cut the um, uh, the contact down. I'm going to cut the contact now and then wrap up this video, and then I'll give you another sh uh, shout on Zello after. Okay, so. Um, okay, Carl. Yeah, uh, very difficult for me uh, with with that one. Uh, Obviously, the uh, the antennas set up between the two locations uh, isn't isn't the best. Yeah, no worries, buddy. No thanks for that. It's a good test. Um, it proves that the radio is working anyway. I'm just going to wrap this video up and then I'll give you a call back on Zello. Yes, okay, my friend. Speak to you whenever you're free. Cheers for now. 
so um, yeah it works um, I I can either run it off the this power supply here I have got a battery that I use on the 320 that will also run the radio but I'd, I'd like to try and set this radio up in the radio room somewhere maybe at the back over here and then run the power supply next to it somewhere so I just need to make some room for it and, and actually get it plugged in so we can use it a bit more but uh, well thank you I hope that video was useful uh, thanks for watching and uh, please if you like the video hit the subscribe button and you can also hit the uh, like button as well and you can also get notifications as well on the channel so look forward to the, to the next video and uh, uh, yep yeah, bye bye for now